Hi, I'm Celeste and I'm going to show you how to crochet a tablet sleeve. So first you're going to just start your chain and then you're going to chain 32. So 29, 30, 31, and 32. Now you're going to double crochet in the fourth loop from the hook. So one, two, three, four, this loop, and we're going to do the back loop only. And then keep double crocheting all the way across. Okay, so now I'm at my last stitch in the row, and we're going to double crochet in it. And then instead of turning, we're going to just rotate it so that the top is the bottom, the back loops are now the front loops, and you're going to start double crocheting in those loops. So we're still doing back loop only, but since we rotated instead of turning, we're just working on the opposite side of what we just finished. And you're going to keep doing this all the way across. Now since we started with 30 and we've been doing actually two double crochets in each loop, one on top and one on bottom. By the time you get to the end you should have 60, so I'm at 58. Sixty. Now number sixty will be in the bottom of this chain three that was our first double crochet. Now you're going to go to that top of that same chain three and you're going to slip stitch to join. So you go through the top, yarn over, and you pull through both loops on the hook to slip stitch. And now we can see we've got some corners here and here for where our tablet is going to sit. So now we're just going to start working in the round and you chain three that's your first double crochet. Then you're going to double crochet in the next stitch. And in every stitch around until you get back to where you started, right here with this chain three. And then you're going to join with another slip stitch. And you're just going to keep doing that until it's the height that you want. So use your tablet as a guide. So I've just finished my last row. I did 24 rows for my tablet sleeve. And now I'm going to do some pretty edging. So what I'm going to do first is chain one, and then in the next stitch, I'm going to single crochet. Then I'm going to chain three. And then I'm going to do two double crochet. We're still working in that same stitch. And then you're going to skip the next two stitches. So we're going to skip this one and this one. And we're going to the third stitch and we're going to do it Again, single crochet, chain three, and two, double crochet. 
and you're going to keep doing this all the way around. Now there's 60 stitches here, if you'll remember, and this takes up three because you do your stitches in one and then you skip two. So you're going to have a total of 20 when you get to the end. So now I'm getting towards the end. I just have one more of these edgings to do. So single crochet, chain three, To double crochet and then what you're going to do is the chain one that we did here you're going to just slip stitch into that and then you're just going to fasten off the ends and weave in your loose ends and then I'll show you how to put in a lace through here to cinch it tight at the top. So I finished weaving in my ends and now I'm going to show you how to lace it up so you have something to uh, cinch this in with. Now when I put my tablet in here I found out that um, the top of my tablet comes to about row 19. I want to go a little bit above that so I'm going to go to row 21. Now I've put a safety pin on, I chained about oh, about 150 stitches, which I think will be plenty long enough. And I put the safety pin on it so I have something to hold on to. And I'm just going to weave back and forth in row 21. and I'm just gonna go around until I have it all the way threaded. Then when you get it threaded all the way through you just pull it tight and tie a little bow and there you have it. You have a crocheted sleeve for your tablet.